Okay, recording is going. Microphone's down. Dog's in position. Yep. Are we ready? I left ready. Okay. Tao's ready. No man, no man are you ready? <laughs> he looks ready. Wag, 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 wag. Alright, let's do this. Welcome, everyone. Welcome back to Nomad's Couch. We've been gone for a long time. Because I've been sick. He almost died. I did. I'm still kind of sick, too. So, excuse my voice for being even more nasally than normal. Hey, we're playing Neon Altar. Remember that game? It was a fun game. What? It was a fun game. It is a fun game. Episode 2 just came out this week. We can continue our playthrough. Nomad looks like he's ready for it. Nomad's gonna be playing the Fire Witch today. Okay. That means we have to go buy him a phone, though. It's alright. He can use my old chocolate. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think Ian Alter will work on that. Okay. Episode 2. Whispers in the Catacombs. Having defeated the Wolf of Ariel and broken the Siege of Tarnum, you are finally released from your obligation to the Brotherhood of Keepers. You can now pursue your own goals deep below Old Tarnum, but even now a dark force in the catacombs below is raising an army of the dead to stop you. Uh, I Ow! Did... What? There is a spider. <laughs> well, it's a good thing it's not an army of spiders. I'm okay. <laughs> you okay? Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'd be lying if I said I remembered everything that happened. So hopefully there's a recap. Just for everyone's knowledge, Tao is terrified of spiders She's, in real That's life. the only thing she's scared of. We were going to do a Halloween special, but we can't play scary games because she doesn't get scared of games. I thought about playing Earth Defense Force because it's got giant spiders in it. But in game spiders don't, don't scare me. Just real spiders. <laughs> but aliens scare you. What if they're alien spiders? But in-game aliens don't bother me. It's real aliens. <laughs> don't die, Alice. This cough button's going to get a lot of use, but it's not going to work very well because Tao's mic can still pick it up. Nomad's giving you the eye, yo. Because he's worried about all the sounds I'm making. I'm super phlegmy. Are you okay, dog? All right, here we go. Are we loading? There we go. Help. Help. <laughs> he gonna die. The hell is that? Obviously, the Why thing so that's choppy? gonna make him die. Hold on. Okay. Um, that's as good as I'm probably going to get it if I want to keep it at 1080. I had to turn the graphic settings down, which kills me inside. I'm going to go over here. Uh, okay. I forget what my dude's powers are. We're using the same characters as last time. I'm the paladin guy. Tao is the... What are you? Fire druid? Mage. Fire Mage. Why did I think you were a druid? Because she's dressed in green stuff. Oh. Um, I have no ranged attacks, right? I'm going to go here. Yeah, I've got like a widespread swing. Why is there no music? Is there music? I guess there's no music. Okay. Um, I don't have any... And, uh, uh... Oh, this is a chump fight. Okay. Spoke the truth. The dead have risen below 
The Solus, they've made it all the way here from Ariel. How is that possible? I will order my men to secure the way back to the fortress above. As for you, my friend, I'm here to relieve you of your duty to the Keepers. May the light guide you, Grand Keeper. It has been an honor. Uh, are you getting quest text over there? No. No? Okay. Uh, mine says, your holy orders are to destroy Zanquin's wish, but your oath to Meldon demands that you rid the world of the abomination of the soulless. So I have to go kill all the zombies. You have to discover the location of the wellspring. A doubt has begun to form in your mind. What if this wellspring is the source of Davin's power? It's dangerous to go alone, especially with the solas roaming about the catacombs. Click. There we go. I'll stay with you guys a while longer. Barrison would not say guys. You'd be at the mercy of the solas if we went our separate ways. Sounds good. <laughs> a stirring performance, Tao. That's pretty much how she said it. Mine. Oh, okay. You'd think a dead body would be an object. It ain't, though. Is this? What is this? Thing? Oh, it's a torch on the wall. Okay. Uh, catacombs. I'm down here. Trying. Controls are fiddly. Ooh, what's that? Thingy. I don't think you should walk in that circle. Are we supposed to have music? Let me check the like sound settings. This game's auto settings did not translate to 1080 very well. I had to redo a bunch of things. Uh, music volume. Yeah, why'd that get turned all the way down? It's like it reset. I think we gotta go in the thing. Yeah, this looks like a mini boss. <clears throat> you probably should have let me go first. We could both have to be in it before it triggers anyway. Who goes there? Me. <laughs> This is the second ghost you met. What dark force is bringing them back from the death? You should try and find out. It's all right. You're safe. I'm Moran. Who are you? I'm Sylvain, apprentice to Tarnum's master of coin. Lavanis. Have you seen him around? I must talk to him. The ghost doesn't even seem to realize she's dead. Or ghost. Sorry, Sylvain. We didn't see. No master of coin. That's exactly Didn't what he said. Didn't see no master? Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> He's gone to check on Lady Olivia's accounts. We're trying to settle Olivia's estate. That was days ago. Think it was days? He's got to return soon. Realizing she's a ghost will come as a shock. Ask her. Ask how she came back or tell her she's dead. I'm going to ask how she came back. Sylvain, what are you doing here? Why did you come back? Or did something drag you? Why do you speak to me like I'm not alive? I... I'm alive, right? Oh my god. I can't remember. We were safe, hidden from the invaders. Then the lady. She promised they'd save us. But no one came. I... Oh. The remains of Lady Olivia were... And her court were never found. This could be our chance to find out what happened to them. Well, the ghost kind of disintegrated. I guess we go this way. She had a panic attack? She had a panic attack that made her disintegrate. The worst kind of panic attack. Corpses. We're bringing more to flush out the cell swords in the east wing. Good. 
Our Lord Davian will be pleased. Wait, this one's skull was split open. Uh, yes, I was aiming for the jugular, but he tried to dodge. It happens. Is that a problem? We need the brain and organs intact for the soulless ritual. Try and avoid the head and torso. Better to hit an artery than let them bleed to death. Oh, I'll be sure to tell the next cell sword I butcher to hold still. Ugh, the voice acting. <laughs> the Zyquinists are conducting their ritual in the West Wing, but Davian is likely to be with the Blood Guard in the East. You'll have to decide which lead to follow. Follow Davian or investigate rituals. Ooh. Well, in character, I would want to take care of that ritual thing. <laughs> I pick to follow the rituals. West is the better option. You'll need to observe one of the Zanquinist rituals to determine if they're using the Wellspring to raise the Solus. The catacombs extend to the east and west from here. You and your companions will need to decide which way to go. We can go east or west. Whatever we decide, better not split up. What with the Blood Guard and the Solus roaming the place? I'd love to catch Davian, but the cultists will overwhelm us with the bodies of the dead if we don't stop them. Your duty commands that you cleanse these catacombs of the soulless plague. You may dis you must disrupt this ritual at any cost. My responsibilities lie in the western wing with the cultists. Everything else is secondary. The order of light and truth will not tolerate these unholy rituals. I guess we're going west then. Barrison says that like the other person in the party didn't just suggest that. Yoo-hoo! All this. Oh, that's a hole in the ground. Not go that way. Anything. Probably check and see if I can craft something. I'm sorry, am I taking all the shinies from you? It's okay, I'm used to it. 